Hey fans of true metal, vinyl collectors, uh, record spinners, uh, music lovers, rockers and rollers, people that have an allergy to lame mainstream music like I do, let me present you a great underground classic that I finally got on double vinyl after all these years. Um, I had the album on cassette when I was a kid and, you know, I, um, I lost it, or one of my so-called friends probably stole it when I wasn't looking, but, uh, I really loved this album at the time, it's a Raven, Nothing Exceeds Like Excess, it's the first album with their new regular drummer, uh, Joe Hasselvander, also of, uh, Pentagram fame and other, you know, hard and heady bands he's been in and out of, and, uh, but his mainstay has, over the years since the late 80s, has been Raven, and, uh, yeah, and, and, yeah, so basically he's, uh, he's as much of a member of Raven as the two original Gallagher brothers, and again, uh, you know, during the mid-80s they had, like, a lame commercial period, they were on Atlantic Records, so they, even though they still put out some hard and hitting sounds, I think they were becoming more radio friendly, and in the beginning Raven, um, was uh, originally from the United Kingdom, you know, the British heavy metal wave, the new wave of British metal. Uh, Raven was part of that when, you know, before uh, John and uh, Mark Gallagher came over to America and moved to the uh, D.C. metro area, which they still live. Sterling, Virginia, just a stone's throw away from the D.C. metro area. And, and uh, of course, their drummer, you know, he's a native of the... Uh, you know, Northern Virginia, greater D.C. metro area, and, uh, I had the honor of meeting them and seeing them in concert, but, uh, this was, a this came out, I believe, in 88, or, or, I believe it was released in 89, but, uh, they were also on the, uh, Ultimate Revenge, uh, live album, which is a compilation live show in, uh, Philadelphia, uh, definitely check that out, but, uh, this is a really good comeback album, even though at, the, at that time, you know, thrash metal was pretty much, you know, at that time, thrash metal took over the metal scene, the, and, you know, they were probably considered kind of old hat by then, they still had a loyal fan following, in fact, a lot of those, you know, thrash metal bands that, you know, took, uh, took the, uh, scene by storm, and, you know, from the later in the 80s, they gave props to Raven, like, you know, Testament, uh, Metallica. I mean, the, the, they were listening to these guys when they were still, you know, nobodies in the, you know, 1981, 82. And um, so they were a big, even though they're not a thrash metal band, more traditional, high-energy, powerful heavy metal, um, no-frills heavy metal. And the, these guys were a big influence on the thrash metal bands that, came later. In fact, they're from just as much as Venom, who um, was also from the same hometown as the uh, Gallagher Brothers, Norwich, England. And uh, yeah, they're very uh, lively show. They're r really a lot of fun to watch. And, but uh, I got it at a slight discount online. I got it for 10 I would have paid 20 at least for this because it's double vinyl. Looks good. I'm not pulling the records out because it's just black vinyl. And you get all these cool little pictures of, you know, Raven in their younger days when... There's Joe Hasselvander. And, uh... Yeah, it's just, uh... Again, this is really a fun album from start to finish. I'm so looking forward to spinning this. And, uh, when I get my new Ion turntable, you know, I'm... I'm definitely going to upload it to digital. I have so much music I want to save and preserve. And, uh, but this is definitely, in the latter days of Raven, you know, I say the best, my favorite Raven albums are from their earlier years. You know, like, uh, you know, Rock Until You Drop, All For One, you know, Smash Bang Wallop, um, and this one, because, I mean, this one is, just as hard and heavy, even a meaner record than Rock Until You Drop and their other famous ones like Wiped Out. Just just a great, you know, no-frills heavy metal album. 
all together, and I love it from start to finish. And that's it for Raven. Nothing exceeds like excess. Check out some tracks from this album if you can. You won't regret it. Rock on. Stay l stay metal.